Hey everybody, welcome back to Matt's Ice Cream Show. Today we're going to be doing Stop and Shop Churn Style Moose Tracks. The Reduced Fat Kind. Um, actually, I ordered this on purpose. I was lo actually looking for uh, Moose Tracks. Found the Reduced Fat Style, so I thought I would go with it because I know some of you are fans of me doing other things besides just regular American Center ice cream. You do it. Who is a fan of Moose Tracks? My grandmother used to love it. Uh, put it down in the comments below. Let me know also while you're there. If you're not subscribed already, please subscribe. Greatly helps out my show. Thank you so much. You can also find links to my Instagram, my Patreon, and other things below. I appreciate all your support. It really, really, really helps me out for the calorie conscious crowd. This is nine servings of 200 calories. So if my math is good, I believe this is 1,800 calories overall. So I'm going to shut up and get into it. This is one of my actually favorite flavors of ice cream. Uh, right away, I know what I notice that sticks out is that it's it's definitely lighter, not as much fat content. There's some peanut butter on the backside. Um, definitely not nearly as much sugar as I would like in the vanilla, but overall, it's definitely not that bad. This is vanilla reduced fat ice cream. That's probably the reason for the less sugar. <laughs> With peanut butter cups and famous moose tracks fudge. I do like the way that the fudge and the peanut butter goes together. Admittedly, it's not... It's, it's a light ice cream. I mean, you can't really expect so much out of it. And it is an economy brand. Or, you know, average at best. Um... called the Denali Original. I'll have to look for the other one. I wasn't even sure what brand this was. I had to look it up on Google because it doesn't really say on here. You see this right here? So I had to type in uh, grocery store logos and look this up. But yeah. So anywho, everybody, we're in December. I'm almost done with my plumbing school. Yeah. Who is ready for Thanksgiving? Me. Right here, direct from the lamp. Who saw that movie, Aladdin? It's a good movie. Anyway, we're moving on. Uh, sorry, kids. It was a great time to be alive in the 90s when all the Disney movies were coming out. I was there, front and center. But seriously, um, what's everyone doing for Thanksgiving? Are you going to go see your families? Are you going to be traveling? I keep dropping ice cream on this show. Also, one of you sent me a or somebody sent me an apron. I have no idea who it was. I gotta find it. I'm gonna start wearing it on this show, or at least some, because I'm really good at getting uh, ice cream on myself. And it's uh, not fun. It's very annoying. I've ruined quite a few shirts. So, but yeah. Definitely a fluffier texture. Honestly, it's not very creamy, even though it's melted more. It's not very creamy in texture. It's also not very creamy just in general. All right, let's wrap this up because I'm not going to eat all this now. But uh, let's go ahead and give you a little, a little flavor. Also, by the way, a little flavor, <laughs> a little score. By the way, real quick before I forget, um, everybody for the chilling chats, thank you so much. Uh, I appreciate all your love. It really means a lot to me. Put down in the comments below what other chilling chats you would like to see, what other subjects you'd like me to broach or talk about. Um, I was thinking about doing like the history of ice cream or maybe some more personal stuff, some more mental health stuff, but please put it on the comments below. Let me know more. It would be greatly appreciated. Also, while you're there, what do you think about last ice cream? I thought it was pretty good. Make sure to go check out last ice cream. Put it on the comments of that video. See if you can find it. Let me know what you think about it. So, scale of 1 to 10... Or scale of 1 to 100, 10 point grading scale. It's not overly, um, it's a light ice cream. Honestly, it's not one of the best ice cream, light ice creams I've ever had, or reduced fat ice cream. Um, it's definitely not one of the best I've had. It's not bad, but it's definitely an economy brand. For an economy brand, scale of 1 to 100. Can you do it? 
I'm going to have to give it like a, a 75. I'm going to tell you why. This is absolutely one of my favorite flavors, hands down, without question. I love the peanut butter and I love the uh, the fudge and the way it rolls with the vanilla. I'm a big fan of Moose Tracks. This particular ice cream, it, 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 even for a lighter ice cream, it's still lacking, or I'm sorry, a reduced fat ice cream, it's still lacking fat to the point where it's actually not very, it's not horrible, but it's really not that great. But it, it, it's definitely missing that ice creamy back hit of fat. And I say that because other brands, even like Halo Top and, and Briars, etc., they can pull that off a little bit better for sure than this. This is definitely an economy brand ice cream. The chocolate, it's not very chocolatey, not very sweet. Again, I do realize it's reduced fat ice cream, but even for a reduced fat ice cream, it's kind of lacking. The peanut butter is probably the best part about this, but that ain't really saying much because... Yeah, you know, can you do it? It's not really saying much because, to be honest, like I said, it's, it's just kind of lacking overall. So I'm going to give it a 75. In other words, like, it's not the most horrible ice cream I had, I've ever had. I would probably eat it again, but I'm definitely not going to go out of my way to, to eat it. I'm definitely not going to uh, recommend it to anybody. If it was at somebody's house and they offered it to me, I might have some. But overall, we'll give it like a 75. So like a solid C, but it's nothing special. So anyway, go out there if you have a stop and shop near you. See if you can find this. Try it out. Let me know. Put it in the comments below. I really don't think you're going to be missing much, but try it anyway. It really helps me out. If you're not subscribed already, please subscribe. Make sure to like this episode. Uh, like I said, if you can find our links below for our, uh, our Instagram and our Patreon, go to our Instagram the week before. You can find out the ice cream we're eating the week of. And get it. Come eat it with us. Tell your friends, tell your family. We'd love to have you. Um, thank you guys so much, old fans. Thank you so much, new fans. Welcome. If you're on YouTube, check us out on Instagram. If you're on Instagram, check us out on YouTube and the old, whole little spill that I give every time. Thank you guys so much for tuning in. I appreciate it. It really makes my day. And I will see you next time, guys. Mm -hmm.